Right. On Thursday, right, and then Friday Jeez. we got a big something with um, for New Year's Eve. New Year's Eve, right, and then um, we're planning to do a free type of show for the fans that were disappointed the night uh, a Boxing Day night. What we want to do is you you come, you buy one flask of Street Vibes rum, and you enter for free. I enter for free, right? right. We we we're planning to do that. Um, Either sometime this week, maybe Sunday or next Wednesday. We're still up in the air. The, the building's also planning to do something for um, Ding Dong, uh, Ravers Clavers, the mm -hmm. gentleman that's sick in America right now. Yeah. We plan, um, Ding Dong is trying to put together a charity event in the building that's going to come up before all the foreigners leave. And we get all the artists to come out and we try to raise some money for that youth there because it's a serious situation. So. All right. Mm, right. What right. What See what situation, what happened? No, he's sick and he needs a, a transplant. And we're trying to raise money for him. This is who? Uh, he's, he's a part of um, Ding Dong's Ravers Clavers. Ravers Clavers. So I'm, I'm doing like that. That's, yeah. good. That's commendable. Respect mm -hmm. that. So the building, I mean, it's a dance hall club. And what them doing right now is a, is a fight to dance hall. It's one of the only venues where, you know, it's okay. I mean, last year they wouldn't give Movado a permit. That's where he kept his birthday bash. So, I mean, the building, is, the, the building asylum, it's a, it's a dance hall. It's a piece of dance hall history. If you come in the building right now, believe it or not, you got pictures of all dance hall artists. Bounty Killer pictures on the wall. Ninja Man, Shaba, we remodeled the club. And I call it the official club of dance hall because we're the only club in Kingston that straight dance hall. So, I mean, the Jamaica people, we need y'all help. We need y'all to stand up and fight with us. And say, please, you know, don't get rid of the last piece of dance hall club history that we have here in Kingston. That's not fair. So uh, we're begging to the police, the higher powers, to look into the situation and just deal with us fairly. If you have a problem with the way we do our thing, talk to us. But please don't treat us unfairly. That's all we're asking for, just to be treated fairly and, and be dealt with like, like any other businessman like Cartel says. It, it's not fair. Straight up. So Cartel, what, 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 uh, what, what? What's in store for the immediate future right now? Well, as I say, you know, we have the big show of Mobile, the New Year's Eve show, the 31st. You know what I mean? And well, and I wish about to be that day. Which part to be that? Tropical Beach. Tropical Beach, all right. See yeah, you. man, it's crazy, man. Jack, you were the show of Barrington and Levy when I perform. You know, John was all long in Jamaica. The right. angel, the funny, um, Tifa. Crazy artist, the funny, man. You know what I mean? Same, so same. It's just a, a Mobile. And of course, the whole of the empire did it. Yeah, because I want youth from Falmouth to keep it. A good youth. He keep a lot of shows in the West End with Cartel. And he said, need me for this show because I know me is a, 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 a solid contender that we are Mobius concerned to draw the fans. Mm -hmm. So, you know what I mean? They're on this show. Big up Mobius. Love, you know, old St. James. You know what I mean? I'm basically, I, 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 I come back the same sentiments that Corey said pertaining to the Jamaica Constable Force. If you have any problem with Vice Cartel and Corey Todd, we don't have no problem for coming in, talk to the police, sit down, you know what I mean, and uh, 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 work out anything where they might say. You know what I mean, them have any issues with, with, with Vice Cartel and Quartet. We don't have no problem with that. You know what I mean, but the running in the club and, and, and the whole frightening, because them think they frighten people basically, you know what I mean, mm -hmm. and, and put a, 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 a doubt in a people's mind. I say, I wonder what they want Cartel in. I wonder what they want Cartel in. So, them think they really damage Vice Cartel image, box food out of Vice Cartel mode. I seven pick me, me have, you know. You know what I mean? I'm mean, not going to make them suffer. You know what I mean? Straight up. So, so, that me have to say. Yeah, man. And Vice well, Street vibes wrong. <laughs> well, well, uh, with that um, um, conciliatory and um, cooperative tone, uh, I hope that it um, falls on um, receptive ears with respect to the Jamaica Constabulary Force. And I would like, I would like, I am requesting, I am humbly requesting that um, some sort of a uh, mature solution can emerge from all of this. Uh, uh, give it that, like you say, you employ Jamaicans, people are benefiting from your enterprise and so forth. And that and, I'm, and if you don't mind, I want to submit to you that if the police put certain things on the table and say, listen, we need a cooperation in this regard, that you too are prepared to cooperate with the police accordingly in order to facilitate uh, in our working relationship that would um, you know, end up being a win-win solution for, for all the parties involved. Of course. You understand? Um, I'm going to roll through the, I'm gonna roll through, um, um, the building tonight. I oh. sit and sit and um, blaze up some 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 vibe some vibes rum. I <laughs> sit and sit and uh, have a good time. I sit and sit and so rock a shanty in a club look more. Everything is there. Chris Cross, we are later. You know not not no man juggle man. Can you go on like you have somewhere for go? I sit and sit and so we just roll through and give us support and thing. But again, 
we, 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 right in a message to it because I don't know say, I, has, I have always been a passionate advocate and a def and defender of dance hall and thing and um and me you know me always say dance hall we have some areas where we have to clean up to do because it takes two to tango well at least a minimum of two and so forth <laughs> and, right so but at the same time we're, we're well aware of some of the you know the unfortunate um, biases that have long been perpetrated against um dance hall and some of the misconceptions and so forth and um we seek to erase um those misconceptions and people and for people to realize that dance hall has been a tremendous and powerful contributor to Jamaica's um, economic development. Mm -hmm. and this has not been documented they can do enough, you know, you know, with respect to not only what artists make, but in terms of all of the branches, you know, whether you were a PR firm, whether you're a manager, a road manager, well, you know, in terms of the crazy money. You talk, whether you even jerk chicken. Whether you even jerk chicken, <laughs> whether you even just sell some, some brew and whatever. It's, it, it, you know, we, we need um, some of our scholars in, uh, at the university to not only document um, the social cultural dynamics of dance hall but to come up with you know to document the actual economic measure the economic benefits of dance hall and we need to put these things on the table so that the policymakers can know that this is a massive industry that in many respects tens of thousands of Jamaicans are benefiting immensely from it and so forth and in this regard um, again we want to champion cartel and Corey for what you're doing because we've seen the hip hop community Community M and M with him shady enterprise. Jay Z is a multimillionaire in terms of um, the business that he has, you know, evolved out of the rap business and thing. Look at Russell Simmons with um, you know that, and then him got married somebody. Him have him did a fat farm and him got married somebody and she come with baby yeah. fat and him make millions and millions of dollars. And we see there are people in Botswana who send for dance and things at Jamaica. I have friends in Botswana, South Africa, Israel. All right, so, so the reach of dance hall is absolutely amazing, given the size of this little island here and so forth. And we see where, like, you know, we see you and Vibes Cartel have made some unprecedented moves with respect to spinning off this thing and realizing some profits. And just like anybody else is doing, if they have a brand and if they have a product that, you know, that is useful out there in the market. So I think that should be encouraged. And I, I know, and I think that if it means that you need to have a sit down with Vibes Cartel and Quarry and the police officers or any other parties involved in order to facilitate, you know, an harmonious coexistence here where everybody can be happy and think people are being the liar, pay your taxes and so forth. I will move forward. The country will be better off because, you know, the, the, the tentacles, the reach out there in wider Jamaica will have people go and benefit from it and things. So, may I look on a bigger picture, right? Yeah, so, yeah man. So, so um, I wish you all the best and thing and we have a roll through we have a roll through the club look come more and sit and sit and party and have some fun and think any 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 parting words I mean and both of you want to leave? Corey? Nah, I think we wrapped it up pretty good. We're all right. Mm -hmm. I'm all right. Yeah. Just big up the whole Jamaica, mm -hmm. big up the Gaza fans, big up the Gully fans, big up the dance hall fans and don't know so one another up on the road that drink. Drink the street vibes on, drink responsibly. If you're not going to drink to the junk, you're going to get one driver designated. Right. All right? Before right. the life get resignated. Yeah. And, um, yeah, um, um, I'm going to make my producer, I'm serious about this, but I'm going to make my producer take the number them for the woman them half the year. Yeah, yeah. my Blackberry I blew up a beer, woman I said, give me number. <laughs> 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 all right then, all right then, Ruth, I'm going to take the number there after you. Cartel, I worry yourself, man, proper respect and protection and strength, see? Yeah, Corey, respect for the rule too and sitting and sitting and, and a blessings and respect, all right? No, thank you, all right. And Corey, we're going to play some, we're going to play some cartel where we call God to, some cartel, God to. Yeah, you see, because usually on Tuesdays it's gospel Tuesdays, you know. So we're going to play some a cartel, God to, and them and say, Chris Cross, kick it off with the... <laughs> Dance, pum pum, bang, go, pum, now.